Hi, my name is David. I'm the literacy educator at the Eric Carle Museum of Picture Book Art. Thank you so much for joining Storytime with the Carl, our weekly read aloud series. This week, we're going to read a really fun, silly book with lots of surprises. Polar Bear's Underwear by Tupera Tupera. Big thanks to Chronicle Books for giving us permission to share this amazing book. There's Polar Bear on our cover. I didn't know polar bears wore underwear. Did you? Who knew? I guess this polar bear does. Oh, poor polar bear. He can't find his underwear. What's the matter? asks his friend Mouse. I've lost my underwear. What kind of underwear were you wearing today, polar bear? asks the Mouse. I can't remember. Oh no, poor polar bear. Can't find his underwear. What are they going to do? Don't worry, polar bear, says Mouse. We'll look for it together. Thank you, Mouse. What a kind friend Mouse is. Can we help Mouse help polar bear find his underwear? Could you do that? Awesome, thank you. Here we go on our search for Polar Bear's Underwear by Tupera Tupera. Look at this colorful striped underwear. Is this your pair, Polar Bear? No, says Bear. This is not my underwear. Whose underwear is it? Hmm. Who could be wearing that colorful striped underwear? Any guesses? On three. Let's turn the page to find out. Are you ready? One, two, three. <gasps> Whose underwear is it? It's Zebra's underwear. Oh, and it's his favorite pair too. <gasps> oh, wow. Zebra looks pretty great in that underwear. I wonder why Zebra likes the, that underwear so much. Hmm. The stripes match zebra's fur pretty well. Ooh, this pair has treats all over it. <gasps> There's a donut and candy and pie and french fries. Mm, it looks delicious. Is this your pair, polar bear? No, it isn't mine, mouse. Hmm. Whose underwear is it? Any guesses? Whose underwear this is? All right, let's count to three and find out. One, two, three. Oh, whose underwear? Yum, 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 yum. It's Pig's underwear. <gasps> What's Pig eating? Mmm, a delicious. Donut. There's an itty bitty pair of underwear with flowers. <gasps> Cute. This pair looks too small for you, polar bear, says Mouse. I agree, says polar bear. But whose underwear is it? Hmm. Who do you think? this tiny underwear belongs to. Let's see. One, two, three. Ah, ah. Who's wearing that underwear? It's Butterfly's underwear. Ah, and there's Butterfly hovering over those beautiful flowers. 
Can you flap your wings like a butterfly? Let's see those butterfly wings. Nice flapping butterflies. Hmm. This underwear says, I heart mice. This must be your pole pair polar bear. No, says polar bear. This is not my underwear at all. Hmm. Whose underwear is it? Who else might love mice? Who else loves mice? Let's see. One, two, three. Oh, oh, oh no. It's cat's underwear. Oh, look at those sharp claws. Oh, maybe cat loves to eat mice. Oh, oh no. Run, says Mouse. Oh, whew. looks like Mouse got away. Hmm, wow. Polka dot underwear with ruffles. Look at those blue dots. This isn't your pear polar bear, is it? Hmm. Let's have a look. Who do you think it belongs to? Any guesses? Let's see. One, two, three. Whoa, whose underwear is it? Wiggle, wiggle, it's Squid's underwear. <gasps> Look at all those tentacles. Let's count them, shall we? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten tentacles. Squid has ten legs. Hmm, what's on this underwear? This pair of carrot underwear is upside down. Is this your pair, Polar Bear? No way, says Polar Bear. Whose underwear is it? Any guesses? Who might like underwear with carrots on them? Let's see. One, two, three. Ah! It's Bunny's underwear. And it looks great on her head. Hmm. That's a pretty silly way to wear your underwear, but pretty stylish. It might be working for, for Bunny. Hmm. Here's some white underwear. Whose pair could this be? Look closer. Any guesses who might be wearing white underwear? Let's count to three and see. One, two, three. What? Polar bear? You are wearing your underwear. Your pair isn't lost at all. Oh, says Polar Bear, I forgot that I put on my new white underwear today. What? You mean Polar Bear was wearing that underwear this whole time? Wait, wait, let's go back and see. Hmm, here's the first page. If we look closely, oh, do you see anything? I don't know, it's hard to see. Why couldn't we see the white underwear on Polar Bear? Because Polar Bear's fur is also white and it was blending in, it was camouflaged. Oh, oh man.
I had no idea I was wearing my underwear all along, mouse, says Polar Bear. Well, that's pretty silly. <laughs> but I'm glad that you found your pair, Polar Bear. And Mouse and Bear have a little song to sing. It goes like this. Polar Bear's underwear so clean and so white. He loves his pair because it's bright. Polar Bear's underwear so comfy and new. Would you like to wear a pair to... Oh my goodness. That is such a silly book full of surprises. I, and that is, that's a pretty surprising, tricky twist ending. I didn't see that coming at all. Well, if you are interested, one of the things that I love about this book and how there are so many surprises in here is all of the little die cut windows in the book, right? There are all these little windows that we get to look through to try to guess what's behind it. Right? If you're interested in creating a book with lift flaps or windows to create your own books with surprises, you can check out the blog post from uh, the Carl's Making Art Together blog that's included in the event description, right? below. On behalf of everyone at the Carl, thank you so much for joining us today and sharing your stories. We hope you'll join us for our next story time. In the meantime, be well. Bye. <laughs>